What's up y'all, my name is Square the Bear and we're back with another dope sneak review. So today is special for multiple reasons. One, we got my brother Louis Guns here, what up, what up, all the way from freaking New York, <laughs> dead ass. Now I'm saying, dead ass. Be <laughs> anyway, we joke around like that, you know, when we're on my dog, my right baby, right here, let's go. You know, we're on stream, I'm always like, yo, New York, I'm always like, New York, I'm always like, Louis, yo, bro, what's up? Um, Tell me the New York lingo, you know, and he's always like explaining it to I me. I've been teaching him, you know? Yeah, he's been gotta, putting gotta, me gotta, on gotta game. Put him, yeah, gotta so, put my, my boy on game. <laughs> <laughs> so when I go to New York, I'm ready, you know? But my brother Louis Guns, you know, straight from New York, you know, surprised us out here. And, you know, we're making this video. He was nice enough to bring the walk the dog. What would he call these? The SB dog dunk highs? Dog, dog walkers? Dog walkers. Uh, SB dunk highs. Yeah. yeah, dog walkers, SB dunk highs. And personally, you know, we had a complex time together. I'm sure you all see in the video. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, like this is probably like my favorite SB dunk high. You know, I think this shows this shoot show. <laughs> I think the sneaker is dope. Like I'm a big dog person, you know? So for me, you know, I could picture myself wearing these, walking a like a low key corgi. You know, I'm a big corgi person, and little butts are cute, you know, or uh, German Shepherd. But this is definitely like one of my favorite sneakers, you know. Um, this is definitely one of my favorite sneakers. I I, I wish I had it, you know, but. Thankfully, my boy Louis Guns over here blessed us with a pair to review and stuff, and we're gonna do it together all the way from New York. Um, but like always, you know, my boy JD's behind the cam, you know, shouts out to him. In the description, let's go. <laughs> um, in the description, you know, have everything, Louis Guns' links, uh, JD's links, um, and yeah. And you know, I just wanna talk about how Louis Guns ended up here, funny story. We were playing Valorant <laughs> on stream last night and we're all going out tonight. You know, we're in the studio making a bunch of different videos mm -hmm. and it's hilarious because, you know, he was like, oh, you got FOMO and then what you do? Bruh, I felt, I felt like I was missing out, man. All the homies were linking up and, <laughs> you know, so I drank a couple white claws and next thing you know, I'm over I'm here. Yeah, he spawned in the... Uh, I just spawned. He spawned, <laughs> <laughs> he spawned in LA, you know? But yeah, so my boy spontaneously <laughs> blessed us with his presence and booked this flight. He's about to leave back home tomorrow, but tonight <laughs> we're gonna have some fun and he's here. Litty. But yeah, we blessed today and like, I don't know, it's a great day. But yeah, funny story, you know, I'm sure there's gonna be some clips here somewhere of DZ's amazing editing. But yeah, so, you know, diving into the sneaker, what do you wanna talk about the sneaker, Louis? You wanna to, want to tell us about more about the sneaker? I mean, the first thing sure is like, I camped out for like 12 hours for this sneaker. I'm pretty sure this sneaker released like on 420. I don't remember the year. 420 Glaze it, I yeah. bet. And I mean, all, all the details, that's what, I think that's what the green represents in mm -hmm. the shoe. It's just, you know. The, the 420, like. 420. Yeah. Um, and the shoe's called the Dog Walker, so that's why it has Dalmatian print and then just a bunch of other random dog prints. Yeah, no corgi prints, so. Huh? Yeah, no corgi prints. That's and the sole of the sneaker, I think, I think that one has the sole. Yeah, this one has it too. The the insole of the sneaker has a bunch of dogs on it, you know. Oh, this is like 420. There's like a little tap, you know, where you could like stash, you know, whatever you want to stash. <laughs> yeah, but, oh, I stepped on uh, the new Call of Duty. I didn't know the other one had it. I stepped on the new Call of Duty update on Caldera. Oh my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Not the Caldera. Man. It comes with an extra. Uh, Bag of laces, you know. But the, it's cute, huh? Cause like, not cute, but. It's like you picked up dog shit, you know? Yeah, cause it's like, it like looks the, like a doggy bag. Like the brown laces, you feel me? <laughs> you know, you have, you have accidentally. You know? <laughs> really what it is? <laughs> picked up dog shit. So it comes with well, extra laces. Hey, the feel about it. Yo, bro, you use those or what? Cause it's kind of so like shit. Like, yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> But that, that's really about it. Uh, honestly, like this pair is fresh, bro. Oh, but also on um, the the Sparky dog tag. Yeah. Comes with a Sparky dog. Tag. Who's Sparky, by the way? Is it just like? A... No, I don't know. I don't think it's anything specific. Yeah. I think it was just uh, a little cool idea. That's what I always liked about SBs. Is like mm -hmm. whenever they release sneakers, it's always like um they add like a lot of detail to mm -hmm. the sneakers. Yeah, you could definitely. the little dog tag mm -hmm. and the the weed pouch or whatever. You could definitely tell that the sneaker has like a lot of details from all the different, you know, types of material they use, you know. Um, I don't know, there's just a lot of little details that are dope, dope, you know, like, I like how on the inside of the tongue you have this SB, but it's like SB poop, 
emoji, you know? <laughs> not the poop it's, it's not the poop emoji, but you know, just so y'all get the hint, but it has a little poop inside of it, you know? It's like pretty cool little I feel detail. like that will be always yeah, stood out with just mm. like a lot of like details on their yeah. sneakers. I really like SBs, and honestly, because of that. So, you're from New York, you know, you, I already know all about this. Well, actually, lastly, you know, not we were talking about what this resembles, but I think I know what it is now. What? The swoosh. I think it's supposed to be a leash. Yo, it is a it leash. Is a leash. <laughs> it is a leash. Yeah, because the, the limited edition box came with a leash. No. And it was that same, it was that same exact pattern. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you just remind me, yeah. Cause so. like, I was like, dude, this reminds me of something. And I remember like, you know, when I was walking my homie's dogs like a while back, I was like, oh dude, it reminds me of like a yeah, leash. And I'm like, leash, oh. yeah. Yeah. But Cause there, there was a limited edition yeah. um, box and it came with leash. Mm -hmm. And um, I think, I think, I forgot what else it came with. It was, it was a leash and then. Um, dog. A <laughs> dog? A dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, think, I think it was like. I think it was like like a collar too or something. I don't remember. It might have been a leash though, honestly. Definitely gotta look look that up. It's probably hard, you know. It's probably tight. But you know, you want to tell us a little more about you know you you and I have talked about this already. How like you used to camp out like and now it's different. You know, it's like the whole pandemic shit. But you know, like tell us how how long it took you to get these. Like what you endured to. I mean. Them. Yeah. When I camp out for shoes, I'm always like, you know, in the front of the line. That's just how it goes. This is New York, stuff. right? But New York. Right? Now, what happened was, um, we used to have the skate shop at my house, and um, it was like a really like low key spot. Um, so I used to always, whenever there was like a release like this one, I would always go put my chair out, and then I would just, I would just camp out. Like, you know, I, I think with like the sneaker, I knew there was gonna be a lot of people, so I think I showed up at like 2 p.m. Slept overnight. Um, I think the store opened at a.m. I was first in line, so I got my size. Um, but what ended up happening was like after the Travis Scott release, a lot of hype built up around like uh, SBs, and not only for like resale, but you know, just like like hype, you know, like mm -hmm. those and shit, like hype ruined shit. And uh, what ended up happening was like the, the skate shop where I used to always go and camp out for my sneakers. Ended up there was like Discord servers, different mm -hmm. Discord servers where like people would like put like locations or people would, like pay to be members, and the um, store ended up getting. Like somebody like told somebody in the store ended up getting uh, not exposed, but I guess like more more attention, mm -hmm. and it, it became it came to the point where um, the store couldn't really handle it. They would normally have like around like twenty, maybe thirty people in front of the store mm -hmm. to like like a line up the block, like, yeah. you know, like 100, 200 people, and they they're not like a big inner city store. It was like more like a mom and pop like skate shop, so they weren't. Um, they weren't ready for that. So what ended up happening is like now, every time they release a sneaker, it's straight up raffles, kind of like sucks because I used yeah. to always line up and you know, be first, second, maybe third in line, normally first, but. So it's like first come first. Now, now it's like raffle. And like what happens with raffle is like, you know, when, when a store does raffles, what ends up happening a lot is like, I mean, like, if you know somebody that works at the store, you know, them, you know, if you're a friend, they could, they could pull your name. Raffles are kind of sketchy. Um, so I've, I've only hit once. After after they started doing raffles, but that's that's kind of like how the game is now. Everything's like raffles or hit online or bots and yeah. that kind of shit. The good old days of camping outside the store are kind of like dead. I mean, here and there you might find something, but it's definitely moved to like more of an online or raffle hit or miss type of. Uh, kind of sucks, huh? Yeah, it's like not like. I mean, bro, I used to camp for yeah. everything, bro. Not even for sneakers, but just like even for Supreme. I used to, so you were first in line for these, basically. Yeah, that's why I got my size. Because everybody's size nine and a half. Like everybody's not. It's so hard to get a nine and a half. My brother is like a nine and a half too. Are you? Yeah. Yeah. But John, <laughs> John, nine and a half. What's up, Easy. Ten. 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 Nine and a half. Next. Yeah. 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 You might, you might have to end up Fights. fighting. You might have to end up fighting somebody for your pair. You, you gonna fight? Yeah, it's happened before. This is how it goes. Louis got hands. She. I don't want to mess with Louis guns. That's what you bring. You gonna be my bodyguard. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate you being here. You know, make sure to check out my boy Louis Guns. Do I drop your other one or no? It doesn't matter. It's like the Louis Guns, then a boy Peso is like my streetwear on Instagram. I don't really use it anymore. I'm more on, you know, that gaming grind right now. You know, playing with my daddies, all my daddies here. Getting you know? carried out here. <laughs> <laughs> and the, the Louis Guns and Gunna Boy Peso are my links. 
Yeah, thank you for thank y'all for being here. You know, thank you to my brother for freaking coming. You know, like can't believe he's here. Spontaneous shit. You know, <laughs> it's like the you know the funny stories you're gonna remember. I mean, last night we were playing. Look at him, straight from New York <laughs> here. Just but, leave like that. <laughs> <laughs> but no, once again, you know, thanks for coming. Uh, this is another dope square the berry view. You know, make sure to check out my Zaddy JDZ um, doing the reviews. You know, doing the editing, filming, everything, and then check out my brother uh, Louis Guns. You know, on the gaming grind. Base Clan, 100 Thieves, who knows, dude, he's hey, fucking talented, he's If you're trying to get carried in Call of Duty, there you go, you know, maybe carry me all the time, and at Valorant, actually, but you know. Um, R.I.P. Call of Duty, man. Oh, R.I.P., the new update R. R. sucks. Boys, um. <laughs> <laughs> but no, um, you know, everything's gonna be in the description below, please check out the homies, and then uh, also let us know your thoughts. What do you think about, like, how things are nowadays, raffles, you know, if you miss camping out. What you think about these sneakers? If you change anything about them, I think they're perfect. I need to get a pair, you know. Whoever's so watching, family, friends, you know. My, my boy, birthday, yeah. Christmas, Valentine's Day, St. Patrick's Day, Mexican Independence Day. I can go <laughs> on, you know. But you know, there's a lot of occasions where y'all can like, you know, get these for me. <laughs> no, but appreciate y'all. Um, have a good one, and uh, don't forget to let us know in the comments. Like I said, uh, what y'all think, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I hate saying that, you know, but. It really helps us content creators. Let us know what's out. your favorite SB. Yeah, let us know what's your favorite SB, you know. And uh, you know, as content creators, we be grinding. So we're not on this whole studio for this. So thank you all so much for being here. Appreciate y'all and have a good one. Peace. They give me a peace line. Let's go. <laughs>